TJ, Holmes and Amy Robach reveal their romance with a motorbike riding through New York City. Together, the former GMA3 hosts are preparing for a marathon after leaving ABC in January. Amy Robach, a former GMA3 anchor, and TJ, Holmes appear to be advancing their romance at full speed. On Tuesday, Holmes, 46, and Robach, 50, were spotted motorcycling around New York City. Holmes was dressed in an army green jacket, red helmet, and pants in the picture that people was able to obtain. Robach wore jeans, a leather jacket, and a purple helmet. She sat behind him, her arms around his waist. Robach shared a picture of the dinner that Holmes made for her after her run on Wednesday. The couple is presently preparing for the New York City Marathon. She posted on Instagram, let the tapering begin. And a big thank you for the post-run eggs and chorizo at official Tomes face savoring food. A few days before to their motorbike ride, Holmes and wife Marilee Feebig finalized their divorce. The 45-year-old attorney filed for divorce from Holmes in December after learning about his previous colleague Robach's affair. The couple had been together for 12 years. Robach and actor Andrew Shu are still legally wed, despite reports that they haven't been together since the summer of 2022. A source revealed to People that Holmes and Robach both broke up with their spouses in August within weeks of each other and that their relationship didn't start until after that when word of their affair first surfaced. A source close to Robach told People in June that the couple was still together, happy, and trying to lie low following their January split from ABC News due to tensions around their coworker romance. Regarding the couple's PDA during the past several months, both domestically and internationally, the source stated, it seems like for a while they weren't bothering with that but now they are making a concerted effort. When the two left ABC in January, a different source expressed a similar opinion. They're actually in love and still in touch with people who work on the show, according to an insider. They understand that some time must pass before they find employment again, but they are not concerned about losing their jobs. Too much is still going on.